The waves of war keep raging through the land, far and near. The cry of hungry children, the pain of falling tears. Patient, gather round the table for peace. They try to Yet war still raises higher, sweeping through the battlefield. Hi, YouTubers. Uh, my name is Diane, and this is my first YouTube video ever. Um, and the reason why I felt led to do this was regarding the situation right now uh, with Russia and Ukraine and the uh, potential, literally, we're on the edge and the verge of World War III. And um, this is desperate, desperate times. And I know a lot of people still have their eyes closed and their head in the sand uh, that this can't be happening or we're to uh, civilize the world, we've come too far to, uh, you know, give in to all this uh, nuclear war stuff. But the thing is, is it's never really ended when you think about it. Um, our environment has become a disaster over the years because of all the nuclear weapons testings and all the bombs that went off in the last century. And, um, and we've got Chernobyl and all the nuclear weapons uh, testing even now going on with the North Korea and uh, all the other countries that are in this arms race, uh, including Russia and the U.S. And, um, and then don't get me going on uh, Chernobyl and Fukushima. Um, that is still, uh, Fukushima is still ongoing. And um, that was actually like a dirty bomb going off. And we're still feeling the effects of that, and we will. So, um, but uh, the mainstream media does not cover, and I think most people are waking up to the fact that, you know, you can't get all your information just from one news network or whatever it has to be. You need to get a balance and find, find it in the middle somewhere of all that information and read between the lines. So, but um, I wanted to talk about the seriousness of this going into World War III because um, oh, I know it is something that is really scary and um, the reality is, is that you could not wake up the next morning. You know, we could be vaporized overnight. And um, But the harsh truth and the reality is, is that there's going to be survivors coming out of these uh, thermonuclear wars that are going to be coming about very soon. God forbid. Really, God forbid. But it just seems that it is going, it's uh, inevitable. You know, we're really going down that path. So, um, I am a retired nurse and um, I've always had an interest in herbal medicines and um, um, knowing which wild plants you can eat and use and harvest. And, and I do have some uh, other prepping skills, uh, little things like that. And I've always been that way. I'm not anyone who just got on the bank wagon for this and just started prepping the last 10 years or whatever. I've always been, uh, for some reason, I believe God has just given me that gift just to be aware of what's going on in the world, whether it's, um, you know, Yellowstone, the thermonuclear wars, whatever, the chemtrails, Agenda 21, pick whatever. Uh, some people will call some of these conspiracy theories too. But I believe uh, to all this stuff, there is a, uh, some, a middle ground where the truth really is. And uh, I am uh, a born-again Christian. I'm not a, a religious person, but I'm a real Christian. 
And through all the news and everything, I just always ask the Lord, just to reveal in my heart, God, where that truth is and how to prepare for things. So uh, my urgency in doing this video really and truly is that we have to do checks with our souls right now. Uh, each one of us will stand before God one day. And if you don't know Jesus Christ as your Savior, uh, I'm pleading with you to, to seek His face through this. You know, seek His face and come to know that uh, He's calling many of you right now. So we will all stand before God's throne one day. And we will all give an account of everything that we've done. You know, but... If you don't know Jesus Christ as your Savior, you know you're lost. You're lost forever. And that's the bottom line. And the urgent is an urgency because you just don't know if we're going to wake up and vaporize or not one day. And for those Christians who believe that uh, um, that the, none of this matters you know, because you think the rapture is going to be happening real soon uh, and that's going to be your way out, uh, shame on you because you need to be warning people about um, the catastrophes and the devastations that are going on around the world. <clears throat> um, whatever, they're standing up for your rights, Agenda 21, um, you know, Yellowstone, warning people that <coughs> 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 I'm my head off. 